Today we're taking a look at Klein's little pocket continuity tester that is for coaxial cables. This little coaxial continuity tester can trace up to a thousand feet of coaxial line and it will tell you if it has a fault in the line or it will also tell you if the line would pass. So what do you get with this pocket tester? Well, you'll get the tester itself and then you get a little female adapter that goes along with it for testing. And then on the bottom, you will have a little remote tester so you can plug this into a coaxial line and you can find basically the other end. Now this will also come with your uh, AAA battery, which is awesome because Klein always includes a AAA battery or a battery with any of their testers. Now what I really like with this unit is that there is a tiny speaker in the bottom here that will beep when the line pass or you're trying to find the continuity in that line. This little tiny unit actually charges through the base of the bigger size unit. So how are we gonna use this? First, you're gonna take this little remote end and where your main lines are coming in for your coax, this is where you're gonna to wanna to use this end of the remote tester. So I just have a little coaxial line right here for demonstrations, that way I don't have to be running back and forth and showing you every, everything that we need to do. So then we take our other end that looks like kind of like a, I, I wanna say it looks like kind of like a crack pipe that <laughs> I don't say that term, well, yeah, I do say that term, but everybody else says, pretty much says that it looks like a crack pipe too. So we will put the female end in on this. And the only reason why I'm using this female end adapter is because you can basically put this in at the end of a wall plate and use it to test that way. But let's say you have coaxial just going to coaxial and you don't have it terminated. You can use this little female adapter that they give you and just use it then. So all we do is we put it on the coaxial and it's gonna start beeping and it's gonna flash green. So the remote end has a little speaker on it that is very annoying. That'll let you know when your line has continuity or if it has continuity at all. There's not two nice things with it. You will, you'll see a green light and then you'll hear a beeping sound. And that basically means that the line has continuity and the line has passed for a green light. Now, let's. what happens if your line is split or you, know, you, you just can't seem to find that line? So we'll put this in and I'll, I have, I'll cut the line or just crimp the line and you'll see what it does then. Okay, so right now it's a green light and now it turns red. So red light means that it has failed and it doesn't have continuity and someone or something has pinched the line, severed the line, and you need to address that situation. So I think, let's take this off, that's annoying. <laughs> so what's the price on this? The price is around $12, 12 dollars 12 dollars I'll put links in the description below on where you can get this. And this is a really nice addition for your communication bag. And uh, I highly suggest getting it because whenever I'm working on a trim, you can basically just put this in your pocket and it's always there. And if you need to test a line, you can just pull it out real quick and uh, test it. I, I really like how that you don't have to worry about a battery with this. You put this in the bottom and it's charging it remotely from that uh, AAA battery, so that's a really nice feature. It also has a clip on the side, so you can mount, you can put it in your pocket. You can clip it to the side of your pants, the side of your bag, and it stays pretty good. The aluminum body is really nice. The build quality for the price, twelve ninety nine, is amazing. It has a nice grip handle. I love it. It's just a really nice tool to throw in your bag and have for that emergency or when you have to test a coaxial line because something happened. <laughs> but 
Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button. Uh, comment down below if you have any questions. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and do so. I'm Philip Bridges and I will see you on the next one.